So today we are at Claverton Pumping Station. And in my background, we've got the old pumping mill, but to my right, we've got the modern day uh, Canal and River Trust electric pumping station. And that's my main focus of work. So the electric pumping station was built in the early 1990s, just after the Kennet and Avon Canal was restored and then reopened. And the purpose of the pumps is to lift water out of the River Avon, uh, push it up a cast iron pipe and push the water into the canal to keep the canal topped up with water, keep the boats floating, keep the fish happy. So the Claverton pumping station is one of several dotted along the Kennet and Avon Canal. Starting at Bath, uh, the canal rises steadily all the way through to Crofton. And along that section, there are eight pumping stations. So it's like a daisy chain of pumping stations. So what's happening is the water is being lifted up at each pumping station, almost like a staircase. Um, and so the daisy chain effect is when, if one pump station was to fail or one pump station was to not pump enough water, you then affect the whole of the daisy chain, you affect the whole of the pumping system, and therefore you can have a very quick negative effect on the whole of the canal system. The 1990 pumps are electric pumps. There's two of them and they are controlled by a SCADA system. SCADA stands for Supervisory Control and Data Acquisition. What that means is that we can log on with a, a tablet or a computer or a mobile phone and actually look at what the pumps are doing, how much water they're actually pumping into the canal. And if we need to increase that or decrease that, well, it, whether it's having a good or bad effect on the canal network, we can adjust it accordingly. So it's quite modern technology compared to the old mill behind me which is uh, pen and paper and, and writing it down in a book. Our pumps are pumping roughly 300 to 320 litres per second. So over the course of a day, that's about 30 megalitres. Uh, and to put that into perspective, that's about 12 Olympic swimming pools a day worth of water that we are lifting out of the River Avon and putting into the canal. So very quickly, when you, when you think about the daisy chain, of all the pumping stations from Bath up to Crofton, they're all doing similar values. So it's an awful lot of water that we are transferring basically up a hill. And the reason we're doing that is the boat traffic is, is bringing the water back down. We've also got leakage, which may be through gates or sluices. And that's part of our winter works program that we always do to, to, to update that. And we've also got geological uh, faults in the area, so there's a natural leakage uh, out of the canal.